What's up everyone, this is Ian with Unlock That Phone and today I'm going to show you how to unlock any Pantech phone. Uh, this is going to be good for any single Pantech phone there is out there. Uh, this one happens to be a Pantech Pursuit locked AT&T. So uh, let's go ahead and get started with the unlocking process. It's very, very simple. So the first thing we're going to do is get the eye in the eye of the phone. Now in order to get this screen to boot up, you're actually going to need a SIM card that belongs to the carrier your phone is from, otherwise it will require um, SOS 911 calls only. So. Um, I do have an AT&T SIM I put in there, and uh, all you do is open up the dialer here, and let me just get a little better lighting here. You're just going to dial star pound zero six pound. And when you do that, you're going to get a screen here that's got your IMEI. It's a 15-digit number you need to every single phone. Okay, um, and then the next step is actually to power the phone down, but I want to show you how so you can get the IMEI without having a SIM in there, and that is by simply looking in the battery compartment of your phone. You can see right there the IMEI of the phone. It's also in the box, but we don't recommend the box. Either get it straight from the phone with an authorized SIM or right here out of the back of the phone, okay? So once you have that number, you head on over to unlockthatphone.com. You got the three drop-down menus. The very first one, carry the phone. In this particular case, is AT&T. Um, you know, it could be yours from whatever other carrier around the world. The manufacturer is the uh, Pantech, and the model is the Pantech Pursuit. And then we're going to go ahead and insert the IMEI right here. You're going to hit unlock now. And in the turnaround time specified on the site, you're going to get your code. You get an email. It looks just like this. It's got a little thank you, the code. You'll have a link to this video as well as anything else you might need to know about your purchase. All right. So once we have that, we're going to go back to our phone. And we're going to boot it up with a SIM card that doesn't belong to the carrier the phone is from. So in this case, I have a T-Mobile USA SIM. I'm going to slide that in the phone real quick. All right. Got the battery. And all I'm going to do now is power up the phone. And it will immediately ask me for the code. I'm going to enter it, and that's it. It'll be done, unlocked for any GSM carrier in the world. So just give it a second here while it goes ahead and uh, reboots. It's coming up, and now you're going to get a message here. It says SIM locked. Incorrect SIM is being used, and you can see right here on the right hand side it says unlock. I'm just going to tap it. It's going to give you a note about entering the unlock code. You're about to enter it. You have 10 times. It's going to continue. I'm going to hit yes, and then very simply, I'm going to enter the code I was given. So uh, let's go ahead here 8101 8101, and then 3380. Three. Three, eight, zero. And then I'm going to hit OK. It's going to ask me to re enter it. So I do 8101 Hit OK. Your phone is unlocked. And I hit yes. Do you want to start touch calibration? No, that's just for the touch screen. So let's just give it a second here. You'll see it's going to pick up T Mobile USA. And there it is on the top left-hand corner here. We got T-Mobile running on the AT&T Pantech. So just quick review, guys. You're going to power up your phone with a SIM card that belongs to the, to the carrier of the phone. You're going to dial star pound zero six pound, and you'll get the IMEI. Or, again, you can check it. It is also in here, the battery compartment, right in there, out of focus. And now it's in focus. Okay? You're going to go to unlockthatphone.com. You're going to put all the phone's information in. You're going to power up the phone with your new SIM. It's going to ask you for the code. You're going to enter it, and you're going to be all set. So uh, thanks as always, guys. We appreciate your business.